Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a set based on pie chart. So there are two pie charts given here. They show the annual expenses of a person in the years 2020 and 2021. Okay. We are not given the total expense. Total is not given for any of the years. So we will have to use the ratios of the total expenses what we will have using the condition there is a single condition given using that condition we will find the ratio of expenses in the two years and hence answer the questions okay so the condition is given that the decrease in the medical expenses in 2021 as compared to the previous year is thrice the increase in the miscellaneous expenditure okay so let us say in this year the total expense was 100x and here the total expense is 100y okay so if the total expense is 100x, if we talk about the medical exp uh, expenditure and miscellaneous expenditure. In 2020, the medical expenditure is the yellow one that is 9%. So that will be 9x and uh, miscellaneous is uh, 6x. And this is uh, here it is 6%. So 6y and it is 6y. 6y okay now what it is saying that decrease in medical expenses so medical expense decreases 9x minus 6y that equals price the increase in miscellaneous expenditure now miscellaneous expenditure has increased so that will be 6y minus 6x so if we simplify it we get that 18x so 27x is equal to 24y x upon y is 8 ratio 9 so the ratio of uh, uh, this is 8 ratio 9 so we do not know the total but we know the ratio is 8 ratio 9 so you can assume the expenses at 8000 9000 800 900 or 80000 90000 whichever is comfortable and answer most of the questions okay so the first question is <clears throat> on how many items did this expenditure increase in 2021 as compared to 2020 okay so we know the ratio of expenses is 8 ratio 9 so total uh, uh, on and all the expenses increasing okay the expenses increasing from 8 to 9 parts so uh, this is 43 percent this is 44 percent so 44 percent of a larger number so it is an increase okay 16%, 15%. 16 into 8 is 128 and 15 into 9 is 135. So this is again greater. So expense increased. For medical, we already know it decreased. So it did not increase. This is 6%, 7%. 7% of a larger number. Okay, so obviously that will be increased. 17 and 19%, 19% of a larger number. So increase 3%, 6% remain same. So they will be increase because overall expense has increased right so it increased in all these uh, all these items except one which is medical okay so the answer is all but one what is the ratio of his medical expenses in 2020 and 2021 okay, so in 2020 his medical expense is nine percent and here it is six percent so nine into eight and six percent of 9 so that is 4 by 3 4 ratio 3 okay so you can assume the number as 800 900 8000 9000 does, does not matter what is the increase in his food expense from 2020 to 2021 now remember in any question uh, di or quant if we are given the ratios we are given percentages we can answer any question related to ratios or percentages or wherever we have to compare which is small or large but we cannot find absolute value see we do not know the expenditure right so we do not know that it is 8000 or 80000 or 8 lakh right or it could be 40000 and 45000 since we do not know these values we cannot find the you can find in terms of x and y right you will you will say that it is 8 uh, 8 800x and 900x so you can find in variable terms but you cannot find absolute values so we cannot determine the answer okay the next question is if the monthly rent increased by 2600 in 2021 what was his expenditure on food in 2020 
now monthly rent increased by 2600 this is annual expenses so annually the rent will increase by 12 times that is uh, 26 into 12 will get 312 and 31200 is the increase in rent okay now suppose this is 8 ratio 9 so let us say the expense was 800a and here the expense was 900a total expense because 8 ratio 9 so expense on rent will be 43 into 8 40 into 8 320 plus 24 344 a is the total rent and here it is 44 into 9 that is 396 a okay so what is the increase in rent 396 a minus 344 a that is 52 a 52 a is 312 okay so that gives you a is equal to 600 52 into 6 is 312 okay now we can find the expenditure on food in 2020 now we can find it because we know the total expenditure so expenditure on food food is the blue one the second one that is 16 percent of 800 a so that is 128 a so 128 into 600 that will give us 76800 okay so that we can find using this so that is the solution to this set and the answers to the questions.